There's no set location for this food truck, but if you follow them on social media, you should be able to find them. Trust me, you'll be glad you did. My name's Josh, and I've always loved food. Home, food, restaurants, you name it, I'm there. So I decided to go around and eat great local food here in the Birmingham area where I live. There are so many great places to eat out here. Of course, I'm by no means a chef, but I can cook. Thanks, Mom. And you know what? Even though I'm not a chef, forget about it. I'm a regular guy eating food. Want some authentic Nashville hot chicken here in Birmingham, Alabama? Eugene's has got it. I'm here with Zeb, about to eat some of this hot chicken. <laughs> That's a mild version. It's not too hot either, to be honest with you. It's still hot chicken, but we have to tone it down a little bit. Dip it in that or? Yeah, homemade ranch. That's good. You gotta try it with the pickle. The pickle? The pickle matters. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, that's me. Yeah, the pickle makes a difference. <laughs> <laughs> Got Mr. Zeb behind me. Delicious. So stupid hot. Just a touch of stupid. It's just a touch of stupid. Am I about to like freaking choke up stuff? Oh no, you'll be alright. It's just a touch of stupid. It sneaks up on you. It's starting to burn a little bit more. Yeah. I may regret this later. That was good. Gonna try this banana pudding, see what it's all about. <clears throat> you are giving my grandma some competition. Manny, I love you. There's quite a bit of prep involved to get the truck ready each morning. Everything's made fresh daily, like that homemade ranch. Whew. But I was able to get Zeb to sit down and have a chat with me while he was at the prep kitchen. My name is Zebby Carney, I'm the owner of the Jeans Hot Chicken Food Truck. My family name is my father's middle name. Passed when I was 17 years old when I decided to start a business. I wanted to name my first company after him. I'm from East Nashville, and that's where Hot Chicken started from. It started in East Nashville in a little hole in the wall called Prince's. Everybody you know who Prince's Hot Chicken is now. I moved to Alabama or Birmingham maybe six years ago. I was just surprised it didn't have a hot chicken restaurant here. It's in Nashville, it's, it's a culture, it's like a barbecue. And I just wanted to bring Hot Chicken to Birmingham. We started doing pop ups at Tracy's Restaurant. Last June, we bought the truck in October of last year. Brick and mortar was too expensive at the time. Since this was a new concept, the truck would make more sense. Sometimes stupid hot chicken tenders are our best seller, or stupid hot popcorn chicken is one of our best sellers. People love the wings and the chicken tender sandwich. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, the website, we post our schedule every Monday morning for the entire week and then we update it through the week. Eugene's Hot Chicken. Please follow us. If you've never had hot chicken before, or if you're a fan of hot chicken, just try us out. I think you'll love it. Okay, so for the road, I had the guys put together one of their best sellers for me to eat the next day. Leftovers. I warmed it up a little bit in the oven just to kind of crisp the chicken up again. And of course, the fries, they're yeah, pretty good for this homemade ranch. The pickle matters, so I'm gonna take my first bite with the pickle. It's got like a little bit of heat, but not too much. Just a touch of heat. Mm. Woo! <laughs> I can see my nose starting to run a little bit. Um, and this is mild, like, I know I'm weak, y'all. I'm sorry, I'm weak. I mean, this is perfect. I mean, look at all this food, though. It's like a lot of food. Y'all don't know what you're missing. That's why you need to go down to Eugene's Hot Chicken. Look them up on social media and see where they're at every week. And then you get some big wings, big tasty wings. Are you gonna eat that? Crunk.